Okay. Done with happy, happy, carnage, carnage. We got our submachine gun. We figured out what happened to all the dead Germans. Um, there's our ladder to the labyrinth. I'm not going to go there. At this point, we're just going to head back to the ground floor and take the down ladder um, th that we didn't take earlier. And now that we're back on We Can See in the Dark, can you? I'm going to turn my flashlight back off because I don't really want to get attacked by rats again. And Similar to coming back down the pyramid from Ascension, we're just running through areas we've already cleared again. Not the most fun, but this won't take long. If I can find the right way through here. <laughs> um, yeah, so taking that teleporter, the secret one on Happy Happy Carnage Carnage would uh, eliminate the need for all this backtracking. So Bungie was pretty good about putting in portals for skipping the boring stuff, if you happen to know about it. But this isn't too bad. We're almost done with this level, and it's just a very short walk through this next one. Yeah, welcome Tasty Primate. But, yeah, very short run over to the up ladder now that this silver door is open and an even shorter run to get back to the ground floor so yeah that wasn't too bad it took us two minutes or something Okay, so now we're on this side of the ground floor, going to go down this ladder, and you'll see why we wanted our submachine gun before going this way the first time. You kind of start out with this ambush of six oozes, which you can do with a pistol, but it's hard, and you'll just burn through a lot of ammo, which I do still have 40 pistol magazines, so I don't have all that many submachine gun magazines, so I'm going to use my pistol where I can. And you could probably just run right through this level. If you know the layout and know exactly where to go, you could probably skip some of these areas. But like every other thing I've done so far in these videos, I'm just going to explore everything. I should have enough ammo to for it not to be a huge deal. Although I might not be taking the most efficient path. Yeah, I think we'll connect up with that area in a minute. And if you had taken the portal, the secret portal on Happy Happy Carnage Carnage, this is the level you'd be skipping. But you'd come back through it later. Because you, you arm the bomb at the bottom of the pyramid, then you have to work your way back up. And it would take you through this level, so 
you'd have an opportunity to clear it out then. Which isn't a bad thing, because you'd have better weapons, because you'd be at, at the end of the game at that point. So there's almost no reason not to take that teleporter, if you happen to know about it. I'm just, again, pretending I don't know about it, since it is a secret that's very hard to find. Yeah, this map especially, you can kind of tell that monster AI is different. They kind of all walk in a single file path toward you. And in the original game, they're a little bit better about fanning out and, you know, not just walking behind each other. But trying to control monsters with Lua is just... It doesn't work well. Okay, so there is a blue uh, potion over here. Probably worth getting. And there's also an MP41 magazine. So it's kind of a dead end don't really have to come this way, but there's some nice things, at least, for if you do take your time, or take the time to come over here. Okay, there seems to be some dead body ahead of us. Let's see what that's about. Okay, so there's something on the ground there. He's got a rusted MP41. I don't think I'll pick that up. It doesn't sound very useful, but he does have ammo for it. See what he has to say. He says, don't take my gold. And if you asked Muller about this guy, he'd have some things to say. Okay, so this is the first mention of this wooden box. And he says, the box duplicates things which you put inside of it. And he's saying the gold ingots wouldn't fit, and he dropped it on a level with invisible demons. So, okay, we know there's a box, we know it's on a level with invisible demons, and we know it's supposed to be able to duplicate anything you put inside, so that's good to know. Um, he didn't want us to take his gold, but screw this guy, I'm taking it. That gives us a point and it adds to our treasure. Okay, so there was some path there that I didn't fully explore, but I'm not going to go there. Like there's something unexplored over here.
Yeah, this game, or this level, just has a bunch of these guys. Usually in groups of three. Kind of this level's theme. Wide open, wide corridors. Okay, so not too much left in this level. Tried to use my orange crystal there, but forgot it wasn't armed. Because, yeah, the orange crystal I just never think to use. This probably wouldn't be a bad level to use it on. Especially if you're having ammo problems. We've still got 14 of these magazines. And then 18 submachine gun magazines, so not in too bad a shape. Okay, here's a save rune, and I think we're pretty much at the next level. So I'm going to stop the video here so that I can start a new, fresh video for the next level, and I'll see you then. Thanks for watching.